All right, y'all, we got my tongs, paper bag. We got the prickly pears. This is what we need, y'all. So this is how we do. So the prickly pear fruit, you're gonna need a pair of tongs. You're just gonna take your tongs. These all have spines on them, so you wanna be real careful. You're just gonna take it and you're gonna twist and it comes right off. And put it in your bag. Check that out. Take it, twist. We got our fruit. I use the tongs and the knife. We're just gonna cut off the top. Look at that beautiful color. And we're gonna cut off the bottom as well. Okay. Then that way, then you're gonna cut it down like this. And you wanna make sure not to cut your hands because there are spines all around it. And then you're just gonna try to peel it back with this knife. Boom. Peel that out. And this is what you get. This is beautiful. And there are seeds in here, so you don't want to eat the seeds, you know, they're kind of hard to eat. Um, you can just eat the pulp, or you can actually make this into a jam or jelly, which it's mainly used for. Um, just make sure you don't get any of those spines when you cut this out. Make sure not to get any of the glockets on it. And then you just have nice fresh pick prickly pear fruit, also called tuna. But like I said, there are seeds, y'all. But enjoy it and don't get stuck by the glockets. <laughs>